Hi, I will show you in this tutorial how to install Mac OS X version 10.11 El Capitan Edition in your PC as a guest using VMware Player. First, you have to download these three files. You can find the links for them in the description. In short, the VMware Player executable file will turn your PC into a host to host Mac OS X. Basically, VMware is able to host Linux and Windows operating system. And yet, there is no support for hosting Mac OS X. So, Unlocker patch will make it possible to run Mac OS X and VMware. Now I think you have a clue about what are these files. So let's get started. First off, install VMware Player. Click Next. Agree. Next. Enable this option. Next. Disable both of these options. Next. Next. Install. Click Finish. It's recommended to restart your PC. So save your work and restart. VMware Player is installed. Next, try to extract the unlocker using one of the extraction tools like 7-zip or WinRAR. Open the extracted folder. You have to make sure that you are connected to the internet. Open Win and install script as administrator. Don't do anything. After a few seconds, this command window will be closed automatically. VMware Player is patched and ready to host Mac OS X. Let's go back. Extract the OS file. Copy the location to this file. You will need it later. Now, everything is ready. Let's run VMware Player. When you launch VMware Player for the first time, you may get this window. Use VMware for free, for non-commercial use, and provide any email address. Continue. Finish. Click on Create a new virtual machine. Select Last option. Next. Select Apple Mac OS X and choose which version. Next. Give it a name. and select the location where to save it. Remember this location. Next. Next. Finish. Click on Edit Virtual Machine Settings. Specify at least 4GB of RAM. 
I'll give it 7 gigabyte. For the CPU, it depends on how many cores your CPU has. My CPU is Core i7, so I'll give it 4 cores. Select the hard disk and remove it. Click Add. Select Hard Disk. Next. Select SATA. Next. Select Second Option. Next. Here, paste the location to the Mac OS X file. Finish. Keep existing format. OK. Now, if you play the virtual machine, you may get this error. To solve it, go to where your virtual machine is stored. Make sure the file extension is shown. If not, then from View tab, click on Options, View tab, Unhide extensions for known file types, click OK. Open the file with extension VMX. Open it with Notepad. Scroll all the way down. At the end, type smc.version equal zero in quotes. Save the file and exit. Now you can play the virtual machine without error. Select your country. Continue. Continue. Make sure this option is selected. Continue. You don't need to enable location surfaces. Just leave it off. Continue. Confirm it. In this step, it's up to you if you want to sign in with your Apple ID in order to use Apple products like App Store, iCloud, FaceTime. Also, you can skip and sign in later. Continue. Confirm it. Agree. Confirm. Provide your personal information to create an account for this system. Continue. Select your time zone. Continue. Don't send anything. Continue. And I have to say thank you Tech Reviews for having this Mac OS X compiled for VMware. You can rename your system partition. Now click on Player. Manage. Install VMware Tools. Double click on Install VMware Tools. 
continue select install for all users continue install confirm type your account password click install software and restart That's all for this tutorial. I hope it was easy to follow and helpful. Please, your feedback is important. Just tell me what will happen with you. Thanks for watching.